All right. So in the previous tutorial, we saw how to create a matrix report and this is the output, right? You would generally add more formatting to this. You will like, you know, kind of change um, this to a more, um, you know, representable format and currency and stuff like that. But um, we're not going to too much of details on those stuff. But what we're going to essentially see in this demo is how to introduce grouping to this table and how can you introduce the concept of drill down and then how can you kind of toggle the visibility. So to do that, it's pretty simple. You see there is basically two set of data over here. One is called as row groups and the second is the column groups. So what we need to do is we need to add a child group inside the territory. That is basically the country region code. <clears throat> so basically the territory gives you the most uppermost kind of data and then you can drill in, drill down into that and then look at um, you know the total due that is split up into country region codes. So to do that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click and say, add a child group. So it gives me an option of, you know, what should I add as child group. For, for now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to just use the country region code. I'm going to click on OK. And you see that this matrix structure has automatically changed. It has included country region code. And here you see that, you know, it, it represents as a hierarchical structure, like un, under territory, there is country region code. So if you click on preview, this will give you a breakup of, you know, um, the data like, you know, Europe, um, there is like, you know, these three country region codes under Europe and so on and so forth. Um, though this will give you a sort of a breakup, however, you cannot drill down into this. What I wish to see is I need to collapse Europe, North America and Pacific. For that, what I need to do is if I go here and go to the group properties, there is an option called visibility. So what I'm going to do is when the report is initially run, I'm going to check, you know, um, hide. So initially it shouldn't be visible. And I'm going to say display can be toggled based on territory. So let's see how this looks like. So you see that, you know, there's a small icon that is over here and then it rolls up to Europe, North America and Pacific. But when you actually click this, you see that it breaks down the total due for you know these country region codes so you are basically controlling the visibility and then drilling down into more detailed structures so again this is like a very simple example this again uses the sales territory and stuff like that um, you you might definitely want to add more formatting and stuff but you get the basic idea this is how you introduce a drill down and um, you know other features into SSRs thanks for watching